Hi everybody, it's Nisha. So I'm making this video because there is nothing else I can do. Um, please, please remember that if you see any of my videos reviewing anything anywhere else other than my own channel on YouTube, this video has been stolen. There is few exceptions. Um, it could be my wig reviews, they could be on reputable websites and um, they have my permission to use that video but also when you see that video it will say underneath that it is me that is doing this video or take you to my link. Um, I will tell you about the reputable companies in a minute. And what I would ask you is please share this video on every platform that you have, especially on Facebook. If you are on Facebook, please share this video, share it on Twitter, share it anywhere you can so people can see it and, and stop being scammed by this company. Let me tell you the story. A lot of you are aware of this, that a while ago, you brought it to my attention and I'm very grateful. There is a company on Facebook with my like clips from my videos advertising their own website where they sell wigs. Well, this, these wigs are nothing like what I am reviewing. They are scamming you. They steal in my videos, my photos. They put in it on their website, on their Facebook page and they pretend that the wig you're gonna get is the one I am reviewing. Well, that's not the case. I have nothing to do with those companies. This is going on everywhere with everybody. I remember even Martin Lewis, the, um, our TV financial specialist, uh, said something like that on the TV, that if you see something with him on Facebook or anywhere else, it's nothing to do with him. I don't go on Facebook and that is the reason I absolutely hate, hate Facebook. I think they don't have any morals, this company. Um, I never go on it. I never post anything on it. I have a small group of just family and friends, but I don't really go on it. I hate it. Um, so there is this company that posts my videos, pictures on their Facebook and I think their Facebook page is Z Lighting. When you click on that, it takes them to their website, which is called Lion's Head. And they have pictures and videos of me. They also have now videos of Taz. Um, and they have videos of the model from Wigs.com. And Wigs.com is reputable huge wig company. So what I have done, I filed a copyright complaint with YouTube because when you go to their website and you see the video, when you click on the video, you can see that this video is from YouTube. So then you click on YouTube and there is a little channel and it has all the stolen videos. So I reported them to YouTube. YouTube removed the videos in the end, they closed the channel, but guess what? The channel is up again under a different name, but it's up again and it has my, I think so far they have my one of my videos and they have loads of Taz. I actually need to contact Taz. I hope you're watching Taz so you can do something about it. Um, so I did that. I filed a claim against them on Facebook. They removed the video from Facebook, but guess what? It's up again. I also filed complaint with Google about their website that they are scamming people. Um, I had to give them lots of reasons and explain. It all takes a lot of time. Um, Google said that they will remove them from search engine. They haven't done that, you know. I wasn't expecting it. But I've done all that. I also contacted the company through their uh, Facebook private messaging, told them please take my photos and, and videos down. They sort of apologized, um, but then they did nothing about it and they continue ignoring me and they know that I filed those claims against them because every time they have their video taken down, they know exactly who filed the claim, so they know it's me, but they ignore it and they keep 
posting it. Now you could say, well, what does it matter? It matters because it ruins my reputation. I got um, an email from someone who watches me and this email wasn't actually directly to me, it was to the scam company, but she CC'd me on this email. And in this email, basically, she thinks that I am advertising those wigs for this company and she said, you know, I'm not going to trust her anymore after this. So she thinks that this is my fault because she received a couple of wigs from them which were terrible quality and, you know, I understand she was very upset. But what I wanted to say is you really need to be... Internet is fabulous thing, but it's a paradise for scammers. Uh, it's so huge, it's so hard. Uh, God knows how many other people using my or anybody else's pictures and videos. You have to be very smart consumer when you're shopping online. And I give you some advice. Whenever I shop online on a website that I've never heard of, I just found something on it, the first thing I do is go to contact us page. If that company does not have the address, telephone number, and not just PO box address, proper address, telephone number, I don't touch it. If you just have, when there is contact us and you just get, you know, standard form to contact them through email, I don't touch that company. Um, the reason they don't have addresses is because they expecting to be closed down so they don't want anybody to find them and then they quickly can open up another shop under a different name and the address is then not important. When I first check this Lions Head Company, in the section about us, they had UK address, the prices were in dollars and the phone number is from Hong Kong. So that already tells you there is something not right about it. Right now, I went back, I can't find the address now at all. There is their telephone number, so you can call them. Mind you, it's in Hong Kong, so I don't know what response you get and if you get any response, it doesn't matter. You can't actually find them physically, so they don't care, you can't you can do anything about it. So that's the first thing I do, I go to about, us and I see if there is address that still is not 100% guaranteed that it's a legitimate company. The next thing I do is I put in Google the name of company, so whatever it is, and reviews because there are people that will review scam companies and say don't buy from this company, it's a scam. You can find some there. Don't necessarily trust the reviews on a website because unless it says verified purchaser review because these can be bought there are companies that will buy reviews from people so i just wanted to make this public announcement for the simple reason i can't keep fighting it i would have to spend my life just finding their videos and keep reporting them and reporting them and I'm never gonna win with that because they're just gonna open it under a different name and do it again. So I thought I'll make this announcement and reassure you that I have nothing to do with it. I mean, you should even think the wigs I review, I always put uh, links to companies that send me the wig, the reputable companies, and you know that this is the wig that you will get if you buy from those companies. So always look under my wig reviews for the links where you can buy the actual wig. See the price of the wig. The wigs I review are, you know, top of the range wigs. They vary between $200 to $500. So if you see the same wig on Facebook for $39, why would you think that this is a real thing? I mean, the price speaks for itself. I understand you can maybe find a good deal somewhere that is $50 less, even $100 when they have promotion. But come on, from $350 to $39, there is no way you are going to get the same quality wig. Another thing is when you actually click on the video on Facebook, you can see the quality, the quality of it is awful. 
You also see there is no my watermark on my video, Sugar Puff and Fluff. Um, they just cover it with their own company name or whatever. It's not a full video, it will be just 15 seconds where I just say how much I love it, but you won't see where I say where I got the wig from. And they just put their own music under it. So you just have to be a bit smarter when you're shopping online because there is so so many scams and also when you read about the companies it's about us it's usually written in a really bad english and then you know that this company is not from here because they can have a um, website address dot com dot co dot uk um, and you might think that this company is based in your country the prices might be in your country's um, currency but you know you have to just read all these things so please please if you ever go um, online to any shop that you don't know for sure if it's reputable check the section about us it's usually when you scroll right to the bottom of the main page there will be about us terms and condition conditions and contact us so read about us if this is written in a really bad english then you know they from China somewhere and that's not to say that all Chinese companies are bad okay and that they are scammers you know they the quality probably won't be as good but that doesn't mean they are scammers um, but a lot of them are and then when you go on to contact us and there is no proper address telephone number where you can actually find them then don't touch it so I don't like making those videos, but you know, I have to protect myself and my, my reputation. It is not my fault if you've been taken by this company, because like I said, there is a lot of things that you should really go through before you purchase anything. But yes, I don't want to be associated with those scammers. Um, and it really, really annoys me. You, as a consumer, all of us have to be just more careful and smart about shopping online. Okay, my lovelies, I hope that will explain things. Um, thank you again for bringing this to my attention and you keep sending me links. Every time I get a link, I'm gonna go to YouTube and try to remove those videos, but obviously I can't spend my life doing this so as long as you know that i am nothing to do with it if you want to find reputable company that sells wigs look under all my wig reviews videos there are different links to different companies and the most the biggest most reputable ones are wigs.com that's in the us sister wigs that's in the us wig studio one that's in us in the UK, the biggest one I would say is simplywigs.com. Um, and if you see my video or my picture on their website, that's absolutely fine. Just please, if you see my video anywhere else that it looks dodgy, <laughs> have nothing to do with it. Okay, my lovelies, thank you so much for watching and don't get scammed. Bye.